Nathaniel with Dragon Blogger Tech and Entertainment, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Anchor Nebula Cosmos projector. This is an absolutely stacked projector that has a ton of features, so let's just go ahead and dive in and take a look at everything that comes with it before I show you guys just how awesome the Nebula is. So the Nebula is going to come with every single thing you need to get set up. So the first thing that you guys are going to notice right here is you get your power adapter. That is a standard three prong outlet adapter. Now what you guys need to know about this is even though this can run off of the AC power, it does have a built in battery that is going to give you upwards of five to six hours of playback time from my testing. And then the next thing that you are going to get is you are going to get this little welcome pamphlet right here. So if we open this up, you guys can see that we have a few different cards in here, such as a happy or not happy card that will tell you what to do if you are happy or unhappy with the product. And then you're also going to get a quick start guide, but you guys shouldn't need this because I'm going to show you guys everything that you need to do to get this working. And then you guys, of course, are obviously going to get a remote. So taking a look at the remote, you guys can see that right here you have that Nebula branding right there on the bottom. You have your power button, your focus button. You're going to have Google Assistant, so you're able to speak to Google and have Google load up certain apps for you or search certain things such as news or weather. You're going to have your selector wheel right here, home button, settings, volume up and volume down, and your back button. And this does take two AAA batteries, but they send it with it, so you don't have to worry about that. And then jumping back to the Nebula itself, just some general specs on this. This is a full 1080p projector, so this is going to give you full crystal clear HD and it's going to look really nice on it. You guys can see that right here you have a speaker grill that is wrapping around the almost the entire length of the body, which looks really nice. Right here on the front, you're going to have your Nebula logo, and then you're also going to have a sensor, so this machine will know if somebody's stepping in front of it and give you a warning not to look into the light, basically. And then jumping over here to the back side, you guys are going to notice that you have a few different items on the back. So right here, you're going to have your power button, and going back to what I said before, you guys can see that the speaker grill wraps almost around this, so you guys can have full 360 immersive sound. Taking a look at the bottom here, on the left side, you're going to have your DC power in, HDMI 1, HDMI 2 with art compatibility, USB and another USB, and then as well as an optical cable. So the extensions that you're going to be able to add to the Nebula itself already makes this so much more worth it than other projectors that I've tested in the past. And then lastly, right here on top, before we dive in and just take a look at how good the picture quality on the Nebula looks, you guys can see that right up here on the top, you are going to have this nice little badge that kind of has this LCD looking screen with the Nebula branding right there, which I just think looks really awesome. So let's just go ahead and get this on a tripod and test it out. All right, guys, so we are now in my living room and I went ahead and already went through the setup process with the Cosmos. And you guys can see that right here we have our Android TV screen. So you guys can see that the response rate and how fast the processor on this is actually very quick. So you can go through, you have a ton of different apps. You have Prime Video right there, some featured apps. But let's go ahead and open the settings and show you guys of some of the things that this can do. So if I open the settings right here, you guys can see I go down to projector settings. You have a ton of options here such as brightness, color temp, your wall color, power saving mode, keystone correction which is going to allow you to manually adjust the screen as you guys can see that I'm doing right there. So it's really awesome, very easy to get set up if you're going to be casting this to multiple surfaces. So now what we'll go ahead and do is we'll just go ahead and load an app real quick just to see how fast that actually responds. So YouTube already is installed whenever you get this. So let's just go ahead and open YouTube for the first time and see how long it takes to load up. So you guys can see there that the processor already loaded that up. We'll go ahead and just click into my email right there. And skipping forward, you guys will see that it is loading now. The loading speed is going to be determined a little bit by how fast your internet is. But you guys can see right there, loads up very quick and it's such a crisp picture. All right, guys, so we do have some video playing, and I just want you guys to look at how absolutely awesome the picture quality on the Cosmos is. You guys can see here that the picture and the color is just true to tone, and the saturation and just the color hue in general just looks absolutely brilliant on this. Let's go ahead and play a more high-speed video so you guys can kind of see how that works, and we're also going to test the audio when we play the high-speed video. 
Alright guys, so we went ahead and switched over to my phone cam just so I can give you guys a little bit more of a true to tone depiction of how the sound is on the Cosmos. So let's go ahead and play this video and you guys will notice over here on the right side of the screen I will turn it up gradually just so you guys can hear how good this sounds. If you guys have a gaming computer, you can download Steam Link. And what Steam Link is going to allow you to do is basically stream your games directly from your PC to this. So you guys can see right here, I have NBA loaded up. And we'll just go ahead and take a look at how good the game looks. And honestly, this is going to be such a great way to play video games. Honestly, it's so awesome that you're able to do this. And as you guys can see right there, I'm just super good at like pretty much every game I ever play. Let's see if I make it again. All right, I definitely should have made that. The game is definitely cheating me. And as you guys can see right here that I actually have the overhead light on in my house and the brightness on this is acceptable. So if your wife comes in whenever you have the blackout curtains going and it's the middle of the day and you're watching football, you're still gonna be able to see what you are watching whenever she turns on those lights and tries to get you to get up and do dishes or something like that. So overall, my friends, Anchor absolutely knocked it out of the park with the Cosmos. Now, I did not expect any less from Anchor because it seems like every single thing they touch and every new thing that they make, they just exceed and exceed and exceed my expectations. So if you guys have been looking for a really awesome projector, the Cosmos is definitely going to be the one for you. With Android built in, Bluetooth, a stunning and vivid picture quality, and awesome speakers that get very loud but also don't sound bad whenever you do turn it up loud, this is just the projector that you guys definitely have to take a look at. So if you guys have been looking for a new one, like I said, definitely check out the Cosmos. Thank you for watching this video, and I hope you guys have a great day.